And the pastor starts talking, and I start to realize that everything that this man is saying, he's saying it right to me, and I got angry. <laughs> I got really angry because I looked over at my birth dad and I thought for sure he had told this guy, listen, there's a charity case in the house tonight and if you could just like get her saved, you know? And I'm like, how dare you tell him about my life? You don't even know me. But something inside of me is still leaning in and still listening to this man. And he starts talking about the love of Jesus. And I'd heard this probably 50 to 100 times in my life. But he says something that I heard for the first time. You know, the Bible tells us about scales being removed from the eyes and those who have ears to hear to hear. Well, that day I had the ears to hear. And he said, Jesus loves you just the way you are. You don't need to clean yourself up to come to him. You come to him and you let him be the one that changes you. It gives me chills now. And I wanted that. I wanted that so badly. I wanted Jesus to take me and just clean me up. I wanted him to make me new because I, I'd spent my whole life <laughs> yelling and screaming and hollering at God and telling him how he ruined my life. How could he let my birth mom not care about me? How could that woman not have stood up for me? How could that man, my stepfather, have treated me that way? How could anybody take people to church and then treat people that way? God, how could you? Well, I found myself walking up an aisle <laughs> after an invitation and I just stand there, and this man was so nice to me because I was a blubbering mess. And he came over to me and he said, can I pray with you? And I uh, <laughs> nod my head. And he prayed with me to receive Jesus Christ as my Savior. And then he said to me, he said, I want you to talk to God right now and just tell him anything you want to tell him right now here in this moment. And again, I'm thinking, boy, if you only knew the stuff I was saying to God, <laughs> I don't know if he wants to hear from me. But I opened up my mouth and I said the two words that I want people to to get this gravity of this, forgive me. Mm.